Ethan Klein and his girlfriend Hila have just responded to Andrew Tate being released from prison and it's honestly extremely entertaining. Their response is fucking hilarious. They honestly are so shocked by the fact he's been released that they seemingly are just clutching at straws here trying to find any reason for him to be kept behind bars or any kind of excuse possible. If you're confused which one is which, Hila's the one that looks like she'd try and sell you crack and Ethan, he's the one that looks like he runs a laser tag arena at the weekends. Wait, so why did they release him? Is there any details about that? They won their appeal on Friday and remain under house arrest until the 29th of April. Uh, none of have them have yet been formally indicted. So yeah, that's the thing. It's like there's not Was anything to really keep them indefinitely for. Are they just going to get off, you think? I mean, it seems like no, right? Because he like admits to all of his crimes repeatedly on tape. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it seems bad for him. I mean, if the judge authorized that many extensions, it's got to be pretty damning evidence. Yeah, I would think so. Um, yeah, I mean, I'd say it's more likely that they, they sneak out of the country somehow. That they do mm. flee to Dubai or something like that. Andrew, stay strong, Andrew. Okay. We love you. We love you, Andrew. You do? Alhamdulillah, we love always. You, Alhamdulillah? Yeah. The Muslims are coming out in support of our boy? You know, mm. he's a prophet. He got in. Before we know it, he'll be in uh, Mecca. Love it, man. Love how he's become like a religious icon to some of them. That's our boy. They look confused. These guys have been traumatized, bro. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this man looks like he just got it out of like prisoner of war. Look at his ass. He's got like that a thousand mile stare, Tristan. Mm, that's weird. I could hear it. I don't mind. Dude, they do not look mentally well. And then. He's the one that called me ugly, right? He <laughs> did, yeah. He's not looking too hot. Mm -mm. You know, mm -mm. kind of a mess. Mashallah. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? How did he win them over so fast? These dudes yeah. have been Muslim for like a, a week before mm -hmm. they went to prison. I, I have no clue. And now they're all riding for him? Like, damn, it's that Weird. easy? Shit, I'm going to have to convert if I get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> Alhamdulillah. He did a rebrand. He rebranded. Yeah. It's good. It's a hot rebrand. You know. So Andrew Tate and his brother Tristan have left prison in Bucharest. They have been moved to house. Tristan's such a bridesmaid. He's like such a little fucking beta boy. And again, it doesn't mean he's innocent of anything. He's under house arrest. They held him for as long as they could. Mm-hmm. Keep putting him under house arrest. Bro, I don't care if he's acquitted. I seen the fucking videos with my own eyes. Firstly, Andrew Tate has never repeatedly admitted to his crimes on tape, but even if he did, it wouldn't be enough to take that as face value and then hold him in jail because there is such a thing as an unreliable source. People can be joking. People can say something and not be true. I mean, what do you guys think of this reaction? Personally, I think it's just pathetic. They, they clearly are just trying to clutch at straws here to try and formulate some sort of an argument because they're extremely uh, embarrassed, I think, and also a bit sort of scared the fact that the tapes have been released. They don't want to admit their wrong and they just they can't fall on their own sword so they've basically just decided to keep pushing forward and i do believe there'll be a point in a few months time where it'll come to bite them in the ass when people start calling them out for what they've said and he gets completely cleared these guys are going to look like even bigger idiots than they already do